What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Um, so I've been getting a lot of requests uh, to make a video for my um, render settings and my frap settings. So I was like, might as well do it now while I'm doing nothing and uh, quickly show you guys uh, my fraps and, and my render settings for Sony Vegas. Um, so we'll quickly start off with fraps since it's already opened. Um, what I like to do, I'll quickly go through everything. Um, that's just the desktop stuff. Uh, so we have this FPS, uh, the benchmarking and all that fun stuff and where it goes to save. Um, so I got my, my uh, fraps overlay on the top right corner just so I can see that it's recording and, and what fraps I'm hitting and if you know if my computer's crashing so I can stop recording or something. Um, and for my movies, this is the most important thing you guys need. Um, this is pretty much where everything primarily goes. Um, as you can see, this is my... Uh, where everything saves. <laughs> you can see I've done this video quite a few times because I fucked up the intro a lot. Um, but this is all my videos and everything. Uh, it's on an external hard drive. I recommend you guys get an external hard drive if you're going to do this, but make sure um, your computer can take it because at the first go, um, I didn't, I couldn't seem to find my USB freeze and it was, you know, I'd hit record and the computer, the whole um, fraps would crash. So, you know, make sure if you have USB free, use USB freeze. I didn't know that. I know I'm an idiot. Um, but my video capture key is pretty much where you hit to record. Uh, mine is application because in games it pretty much does nothing and that's all I pretty much need it for. Uh, my video capture settings is full size on 120 FPS. I think um, YouTube caps it at about 30 but I like just to leave it at 120 because that way um, it can go all the way up to um, without you know without it messing with the game and, and the fraps and all that fun stuff. Um, that's that. Uh, I got record window sound, which is the sound of the game, and the uh, external uh, mic, which is my microphone that I'm talking into now. Um, so I'll let you guys copy that down. I'll just go through it one more time, just like that. Um, I'm sure you can pause the video and have a look real there, real quiet. That's pretty much all you need anyway. This is the main settings, but we'll quickly go into Sony Vegas. Um, as you can see, I'm using Sony Vegas 11, even though I have 12, because my 12 seems to be very buggy uh, a few times you know it doesn't let me drag and drop it crashes you know when I put in a video um, a picture sorry so we'll leave that but I'll show you guys quickly how good these render settings are um, these aren't uh, you know I found these off the internet as well but I'll quickly show you if I remember um, I have free screen so I'm not sure you can see what guys I'm doing right now but you can see this video is the uh, latest uh, video I'll pull it, put it up in here um, you can see this video is 20 minutes long and about 25 sorry and you can see um, the properties on this it's only 355 megs I have not compressed this video at all I have not touched it I pretty much just rendered it out I edited it I rendered it out and put it on YouTube that's all I did with these render settings um, these are probably one of my most favorite render settings I you know I've ever come across um, plus it records it, it renders it to 1080p and it's, it's you've seen in the videos you know it's pretty good um, quality now this is the uh, our intro and I'll quickly render this out to show you guys how good you can get the render settings now um, if you go on this little button on the video uh, properties, um, you'll see it in the top top left corner of the video preview. Um, and oh, this is not what I wanted. Where is it? Um, yeah, actually, yeah, you can use these ones, but I tend to use the 1080p one by 60. Um, there's a few things for some reason this is not saved, but this, it's pretty much exactly like this. Uh, but you can change. You want to change this to best and that's pretty much all I do. I don't really mess with this other stuff just because, you know, I don't really want to mess it. And I changed, uh, it's not 30, but just leave it on 29. And I pretty much don't like to mess with this um, just because, you know, you can touch something and it might break it. Um, but f now for the render settings, which is probably the most important part of this. Um, this is just for the video preview. Um, I, I just use the render settings um, to render it out. I don't really uh, touch base with the, the video preview. But here, if you want, like mine is um, already in a, a favorite, but if you want to go, um, let me just see, it's video, Windows Video Movie Player 11, and the 8-bit one, um, the 1080p, see, you see how many, um, you know, render settings I've had, and I've actually finally mastered one that I'm really happy with, but you want to go in the 8 MBS um, HD 1080p, free, 1080 by free, 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 30p video that was that was ridiculously hard for me um, but you'll open up with that I'll quickly just start it again um, yep but you'll open up with that 
um, and you want to change you want to leave you want to have this like this um, you want to go into the video which is the main uh, mode yours will be set at I think CBR you want to change the quality VBR um, you want to have this on Windows movie uh, Windows media video 10 uh, you want to have custom size 10 uh, 920 by 1080 so you can get the 1080p you want to have the pixel uh, the pixel aspect ratio at uh, one square and the frames at 30 now um, I see no, as you see, mine is on 80%, uh, 86% uh, quality. I see no difference between 80, you know, you can have it to 80 to 100. I see no quality difference. Um, you've, seen, you've seen my videos, once you hit it on HD, it looks crystal clear, um, and that is rendered on um, 86%. You could drop it down to 80, but my computer can quite handle it, uh, and it renders pretty fast. Um, this is just if you want to, you know, offer the, uh, your video bitrate. Don't touch that. That's how mine is. Um, Audio, you want to have exactly like this. I don't think I touched base with this, but you want it like this. Uh, you want 192, um, and you want Windows Media Audio 9.2 and CBR. Now the project settings, you want to just go uh, best, and it's going to give you obviously best quality. Now if you render it out, it's quite a fast render. Um, we'll just what's this? This is on desktop. Yeah, we'll just render this out. Now you can see it's a quite quite fast render for about you know my videos is that at 20 minutes they render in about an hour. And you know, I don't really, you know, I have a pretty decent computer. I have an i5 uh, running about 3:30, um, and you know, not, you know, you can render. It. There is some render settings that you can uh, choose what you want to render off. So you can use, either use your CPU or your graphics card. But with this one, it pretty much, I think, just uses the main thing, the, your processor, um, and pretty much touches it with the most highest, highest quality you can get and the most fastest quality you can get. Now, I'm just having a drink here. Now, if you go open. You can see how nice it looks and how, how crystal clear it looks. Now this is exactly exactly the render I went with for each video I recorded. Um, you can even see once again with this one. There you go. Like we'll just quickly skip to a scene. You can see this looks like game footage. Um, you know, it looks like raw, like exactly from the game. Which you know, this is probably the best render scene you can get, in my opinion. I don't know if you guys have better ones. You know. Smaller quality, but you can see with this, it's it's a 20 minute video, and it's at 30 355 megabits, um, which is pretty damn good for my liking anyway. Especially me being an Aussie, um, we have pretty much I have terrible internet settings. Um, mine's my upload speed is about. I'll show you guys actually my upload speed. Um, I can't be bothered because it takes way too long. But my upload speed is only about you know my 13, um, 13, 13.10. And the upload speed is only about 0 0.80, which is pretty much absolutely horrible compared to other countries. Um, especially, that's why I love having small uh, file size for being Aussie. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, I hope these guys helped you out. Um, and if you did, please leave that like button. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, guys. And as always, I hope you guys had a great day. And cheers for watching, guys.